Hello everyone. Welcome to FrameCAD Structure Know-How videos. Um, this video is going to be about demonstrating how to do raking panels. I've got a small structure here, 8 meters by 12 meters. Very simple. Um, it's got some internal walls as well. And I'm going to demonstrate how to rake these panels in this direction, in the X direction. It can go from left to right or right to left it doesn't matter as long as we set the properties in the correct way so if i go into the layouts and select and list any of the panels you can see that the starting height is 2400 finished height 2400 and the angle is zero is set at zero now we can do this process manually of course but it's a better way by doing it automatically using the pra command the panel rake command PRA. So if you select PRA, select enter. Now the software asks, is asking which panels I would like to rake. I would like to keep that panel set at 2400. And I'm going to rake this panel, this panel, that panel, that panel, and that panel. So all the panels I'm going to rake, I'm just going to keep the first one at 2400. I'm going to select enter. And now I'm going to select the baseline of where the raking is going to start from. So my first two points will identify the base height. And now I'm going to select my direction, which the panels are going to be pitching upwards. So 2400 is the baseline pitching up by 15 degrees, which is the next action on five. And now I can go into my panel 3D command. And you can see that all these panels are now raked by 15 degrees. So the very first panel remains at 2400 and the rest of the panels are raked by 15 degrees. And you can see that the software in a, in a situation where there's a corner, um, you can see the software is smart enough not to make that last panel go the full height because otherwise we're going to clash if you put a roof panel or a roof truss on it. So this is how you would break a panel. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next know-how video.